Hey guys, so um, today is Thanksgiving Day. When you guys are watching this, it's gonna be the day after Thanksgiving. This is me coming in right now to say I hope everybody had a good Thanksgiving. I'm very thankful. You know, I'm thankful for the small things and for the big things also. I just got home tomorrow is thanksgiving which super excited about so just now when i was coming home i stopped at the dollar tree to get a few items i don't i'm not sure what i'm gonna be making tomorrow whatever it is i want to make sure that i am prepared so i bought this potato masher a dollar i'm gonna wash all these i bought this uh slotted spoon I bought a roll of paper towel. I have um, three additional rolls of paper towel. So I bought that one. I bought Ziploc bag. I bought some mixed vegetables. I really like these um, caramel um, candy. So I bought three little packs. I don't know where I'm going to put them. And I bought these Ritz crackers that look crooked. And then... Um, I bought these three, what are these called again? And it has a clear thing on the bottom. I'm thinking it's to close it. Yeah, it is. So, um, that's good. All three will not hold in my refrigerator, so hopefully I don't have to use all three. But anyways, I bought three, and then I bought more aluminum foil. So right now, I'm going to take all the things off of the table. Man, I left the egg out and this morning was not my morning. I'm going to take all the things off the table right now. Oh, it's just so heavy. Oh my gosh. This is my thing with my fruits. Because I want to put a runner that I had bought on the table. This banana, I um brought to work today, but it's super soft and I'm planning to make some banana bread i think that this banana will be absolutely perfect for that so i brought it back home because it was too soft i bought some sandwich bags too can't have enough so yeah i'm gonna take all the things off of the table just got done um putting the thing on the table i don't know if you guys saw or not but a glass literally just broke i'm gonna wash this stuff up up out of the sink i don't know what i'm gonna try making tonight so maybe i'm gonna do um the banana bread just because i could do that while i'm like watching tv or whatever so i think i'm gonna go ahead and do the banana bread because all the meat um, is already seasoned so I'm gonna take those out of the top of the freezer and put them in the bottom so that in the morning they could be nice and you know defrosted enough so I'm gonna take pork I'm gonna take goat I'm gonna take 
maybe shrimp and chicken. I'm not really sure yet. The chicken I'll leave for last. So if I don't feel like doing the chicken tomorrow, then that's in the bottom of the fridge. But I'm going to make some curry goat and I'm going to make some stew pork and what was he curry chicken. So I'm, maybe I'm going to make some shrimp. So we'll see what we do tomorrow. I bought two, um, not two, one away at work today. So because, um, you know, it's the holidays, I got a discount. They were having some for 50% off and others were just on sale. This one was just on sale. So I bought it. Let me put you guys down here and see how best I can show y'all what's up. So I bought this one. This is 26 inches and I can't even tell y'all how much I paid. How gorgeous is she all right so um what i'm attempting to do tonight is to tint the lace i think i'm going to try it with another wig that i have first so if it don't work out i don't mess up the lace on my brand new 200 dollars wig okay but this wig is called destiny it's from a, and it's from a company called Bellatique and they are some really good ways. I think I'm gonna try it on and show it to you guys. Oh, I'm about to snap the swig off. I'm gonna try tinting this lace first and see how that works out. But in the meantime, let me try this on and show it to you guys. It is so cute. I love it. I feel like it makes me look like I have my life together. Okay. Fits me nicely in everything. And I am very aware that the lace is long. Jeez. That 26 inches is a lot of hair. But I always wanted like one of them longer wigs. And I didn't know if I wanted to make it myself or the rest of the hair. So I decided to buy it. And oh my gosh, I absolutely love it so far. Look at that, bad boy. Okay, so today I tried it on and everything just to make sure that I liked it before I purchased it. And I seen something on YouTube where the girl was using um, dark brown dye from a door to tint the lace. So I'm going to try to do that because on this one, the lace isn't like brown skin girl type of brown. So the only thing I have to do is add elastic to this wig. And so far, I absolutely love it. The only thing I've done so far, just now is gonna um, try and tint the lace. But girl, when I put the lace inside of the pot, that color was green. So I'm just like, you know what? I am not gonna mess with it. So I just parted it down the middle and put some concealer in there. And that bad boy already look so good and i really love it it is a frontal so i am able to do whatever i want and it has lace on the back too so i could glue the back down if i want to but you know for a while i've been wanting a wig like this that you know could really make me feel like i'm popping out here and there and so far this wig absolutely does that for me i love it so much look at that and all I did was put some, wet it up, put some concealer in the part, and this is what it looked like. I haven't even washed it yet, and I'd normally wash my hair before I wear it. But this one I feel like, I'm going to leave her like this, and I'm going to put her right back inside of the bag. And when I'm ready to wear it, I'm going to just pull it out. I have a piece of elastic hair that's already cut. And I think I'm going to go ahead, stitch the elastic in there, and see how my good sis hair feels, you know, as a glueless. Hi guys, so I went ahead and sewed the elastic inside of the wig. I also braided it so it was easier, but this is what the wig looked like, right? And it is a glueless, absolutely love that. Okay, it's a little bit off center right now, but you know, you get it. And once you take, you know, once you take it out, the waves are nice and popping like that, you know? Like I said, this is not going to be no everyday type of wig. We're going to just braid it back up, put it into a bag, and like leave it inside of the um the wig drawer. Because I don't need it to use right now. But I don't know. I'm, I'm really, really excited about it. Maybe I should wash it because right now it smells like wig. 
but you know, nice glueless wag. guys so um today is thanksgiving day when you guys are watching this it's gonna be the day after thanksgiving there is a what is this guinness bottle behind me and somebody was drinking and it's not me okay well i was kind of drinking too but not that because that is better so um today i cooked tammy banana bread and you guys saw where i was prepping for the banana bread i'm not in the mood to go show all of that right now but i made banana bread um i didn't eat any of the banana bread though I made banana bread, I made curry goat, I made um, stew pork, and mashed potatoes. What else did I make? Rice to eat with that on the side. Vegetable, like just raw vegetable. But let me tell you something. When it's just two people celebrating Thanksgiving, there is nothing elaborate about it. I feel like... Um, we have spoken about it before and it was like um yeah it is not that serious and i feel like maybe i didn't realize that it wasn't that serious until this year because every other year we would normally go to somebody else's house one it is a lot of cooking i pretty much spent the whole morning cooking and preparing and i don't know but then after that it was pretty chill and um i didn't vlog today so this is me coming in right now to say I hope everybody had a good Thanksgiving. I'm very thankful. You know, I'm thankful for the small things and for the big things also. I'm thankful for life. I'm thankful to be alive, to live to see another year, you know, to have supportive people in my life, to be able to sustain myself as a human being. I'm just thankful for pretty much everything big and small because you really have to be thankful for the small things too and um yeah hope you guys had an amazing thanksgiving and i'll see you guys in my next video